So I came to CSU three and a half years ago um, from Adelaide, Australia, so a fair distance away. Um, didn't really know what to expect, had never been to the States before. Um, the only thing I really knew about America was Mean Girls, so, um, but yeah, it's been a great three and a half years, um, that's for sure, you know, um, never ever wanted to leave, that's for sure. So I think uh, leaving's probably going to be pretty difficult, you know, working with Coach Baker and the team here has just been phenomenal. Um, being a senior has been awesome, you know, working with a great bunch of girls from all across the world, you know, it's been, um, you know, times have been tough as well, you know, sometimes you have to kind of step outside your comfort zone um, and just kind of be like, you know, these, these girls are my sisters, are my teammates as well as some of the best friends I've got, so, but it's been, you know, um, great growing experience for me, like just looking, you know, the amount that I've kind of matured over the last couple of years has been... Yeah. yeah, I think probably the, the biggest part is making sure you're getting enough sleep because you can't practice tired, that's just not going to work and you can't study tired either, so just good organisation, making sure you know when, when you're given a task, given a project, getting it done pretty quickly. I think when you have that day off, just making sure you know you get all those uh, papers organised and stuff, I think it comes down to organisation is probably the biggest, the biggest problem um, and, the, and the biggest key to success because you know, I'm a biochem major which hasn't been easy with labs and exams every five minutes you know so I think just what's got me through is just good organization and making sure that you know you don't leave it to the last minute because it's, it's not going to work. <laughs> yeah. I think probably for me just looking back at you know how quickly this time has gone I think just you know every day on the court you just have to appreciate every moment that you have with the coaches here the training staff the weight coaches you know because before you know it, it's going to be over and you're going to be like, OK, am I playing well enough to play professionally or have I not given, you know, have I not left everything on the court? So I think just appreciating every moment and giving 110% all the time is probably it.